Hi, I'm Peg Bockenheimer. I'm here in my studio getting ready for the Orange County Artists Guild Open Studio Tour, which is virtual or by appointment this year. And uh, I wanted to let you know something about my situation, which is that I have two shows that are going to be up during part of the time of the tour. One is at Craven Allen Gallery in Durham, and that show will be coming down October 31st. The gallery is open if you want to see the work there. The second show is at Frank Gallery, and Frank is open um, from 12 to 6, Tuesday through Saturday, and that show will be up until November 14th. In addition, my husband Steve is sharing the uh, studio with me this year with his handmade books and boxes, so that's exciting. And we'll be making appointments by email that will be spaced out for one group at a time. We also, of course, will be wearing masks and have safety distancing. So I hope that you'll be able to come by, and um, I just want you to know also that my work is always on my website, pegbockenheimer.com, and you can see which pieces are available there. Okay, thanks, and I hope to see you. Here's the inside of my studio. With my favorite sign from my grandchildren. This is the part of my studio where I have my encaustic materials set up. And uh, these are the torches that I fuse each layer of the uh, beeswax to the one before. This is the heating trays that um, I heat the encaustic paint on. And it's a heat gun, another way of heating in between layers, and here are some encaustic paintings in process. I want to show you how encaustic painting works when you're using a brush. This is um, the hot paint, and I'm painting over some things that have already been painted on here. And then I would fuse that layer to the one that's on it with it, this torch. Scraping back into the painting. Hi, I want to show you another uh, medium that I work in, which is oil and cold wax paint. And this is cold wax. It looks like that. And it's beeswax and a solvent mixed together. And then you mix it with the oil paint. Um, on a palette, and um, I apply it with a palette knife or a squeegee. Where you can move it around and over, and um, you can roll it or dig into it, or transfer paint from uh, using tissue paper from another painting. Or just something that you put on there. So there's many, many things that you can do with oil and cold wax. It's fun to work with. The third type of painting that I do is acrylic, and this is an example of an acrylic painting of mine. And um, acrylic paint is very uh, fluid, so you can ha do lots of brush work. And it just goes on very nicely like that. And it's water-based. I also have small paintings on paper, such as you see here, and um, what I call mini encaustic paintings. 
and I will have note cards. This is the outside of my studio. I'm very fortunate to have my studio here at my home. 